Hello and welcome everyone to this short presentation about how we can support you at the Maynooth Access Programme, MAP for short. My name is Katrina Fitzgerald and I am a student advisor at MAP. At MAP, we have a strong and historical commitment to widening participation at Maynooth University. And as part of our commitment, Maynooth University provides flexible pathways to university for school leavers from diverse backgrounds and circumstances. So as a HERE student, you will have come to Maynooth University through the Higher Education Access Route, or HERE for short. HERE provides extra financial supports for students at Maynooth. Also, a wide range of supports are provided by MAP for students who enter through the HERE route. But don't forget, students can also register with MAP at any time during their studies, where we can support you if you develop additional educational needs. Now for some background information about the Maynooth Access Programme. So the Maynooth Access Programme, or MAP is short, was established in 1998 and the main aims of MAP are to support and encourage underrepresented groups to consider higher education as a real option, as well as providing access routes and post-entry supports. MAP also aims to embed accessibility and diversity issues into the culture of the university, thereby influencing and developing inclusive policies and practices. It also aims to widen participation so that all groups in Irish society are fully represented in the student population at Maynooth. It also aims to coordinate a range of supports that promote independence and help students to reach their full academic potential and to work with the university so that students with specific access and support needs are treated equitably. So the Maynooth Access Programme uh, it supports students coming through alternative routes into college. So we support students coming through the HERE route. So that is the higher education access route for underrepresented school leavers. We also support students with coming through the DARE route. So that would be students th come through the disability access route for school leaders, school leavers, and also through the mature entry route and the QQI or further entry route. And any student with a disability can also register with MAP. We also support students uh, progressing from foundation courses, such as a certificate in science, return to teaching and think about teaching. And people coming through these pathways currently make up over a third of the student population here at Maynooth University. Before I go into more detail about the kinds of supports that we can provide for you as a HERE student registered with MAP, I invite you to watch this short video where Leon shares his experiences of the supports that he received from MAP. Now I'll give you a very brief overview about the first steps that you need to take as a HERE student to register with MAP. So firstly, you will accept your offer of a place to study at Maynooth University and congratulations to you on that. After which you will need to on register for online supports. And after this, then you will attend the Launchpad orientation. And please note, as a HERE student registered with MAP, your attendance at the Launchpad orientation is a mandatory aspect of this support provision. So once you have connected in with your assigned student advisor, they will then work with you to provide supports that are specific to your needs as a student at Maynooth University. So as a HERE student, we actively encourage you to engage with us here at MAP for a positive first year experience. So as part of this, we strongly advise that you check your Maynooth University emails on a daily basis because we will be sending information out at various different times during the university calendar and there'll be a lot of vital and good information in these emails. So please read them carefully because they will contain information that is necessary for you and also respond to deadlines. And of course, if you have any queries, this is the time you need to link in with your student advisor who will be able to support you with your queries or concerns. Also, particularly in relation to HERE students, you need to follow the financial steps to apply for funding. And again, this is something that your student advisor may be able to support you with, because we could also refer you on to the student budgeting advice service, who will be able to support you and guide you through the concerns that you may be having. And also please note that for HERE student, the funding structure changes in year two. So in year one, you get a funding source in semester one and semester two, whereas that changes in your second year. So again, this is particular to each student's individual circumstances. So you will need to link in with your student advisor who may be able to give you some more supports in this area. 
So we really try to encourage you to be um, engaged and active and proactive and to take responsibility for your own learning experience. But of course, we are here to support you as part of that. So please do not be a stranger. Link in with us on a fairly regular basis. And this will help you to build rapport with your student advisor who will then be able to best support you and to guide you towards the supports that you need most as you make your way through your studies here at Maynooth University. So before I give you a little bit more information about the kinds of supports that we can offer you here at MAP, I'd like to introduce you to our wonderful advisory team. So you can see lovely smiling faces looking out at you and all of us are here to support you as you make your educational journey here at Maynooth. So our advisory team here work to deliver the student support provision component of MAP's overall work. And we provide the same expert advice and supports. And between us, we have over 50 years experience of providing students with supports in academic and learning. And they are for all students who are registered here with us at MAP. So each of us in the team has our own individual caseload of students who have come to us through different pathways, which I touched on in the previous slide. And we will be in touch with you at different times throughout the year to give you information that you may find useful and to support you through your studies. For instance, we may give you some information about upcoming mature coffee mornings or um, information about when funding opportunities are opening for you. So don't be a stranger. Come visit us here at MAP and get to know your specific student advisor who is here to support you and to help you have the most enjoyable um, educational experience that you can have at Maynooth. In this slide, I give you a little bit more information about the kinds of supports that we can provide for you at MAP and when you link in with your student advisor. So, for instance, in the previous slide, I mentioned financial supports. So your student advisor will be able to give you information about the student assist fund. And um, also we have a 1916 bursary, which is available to some students. And also the student budgeting advice service is a very, very important aspect of the financial supports that we provide for you here at MAP. In terms of the personal supports that we provide, we can refer you on to the counselling services if, if this is something that you feel you could avail of. And we also have the Student Health Centre, which is a really um, valuable service here at Maynooth University. In terms of social supports, we have our MAP ambassadors who are fantastic in terms of engaging students and developing social outlets. Um, also, don't forget to check out MU Life, the website here at Maynooth University, which gives you information about the different clubs and societies that you might like to um, join. And in terms of academic issues, we have um, the Academic Writing Centre and the Math Support Centre, and also offices like the Programme and Academic Advisory Offices, which are very useful resources if you have queries around your academic options. Again, if you link in with your student advisor, they will be able to refer you on to these services. Now I'd like to bring your attention to two other key supports that are available for here students registered at MAP. Firstly, I'd like to draw your attention to the laptop loan scheme that we have at MAP. So you don't have to blow your college budget by buying a laptop because we have laptops available as part of the laptop loan scheme. So link in with your student advisor to get some more information about how you can register for this. And there's also more information about it on the MAP website. Now I'd also like to let you know about the Technology Transition Programme because we use quite a lot of technology here at Maynooth University, which involves the use of Moodle, which is our online platform. We also use Microsoft Teams and emails are a central way of communicating here at Maynooth. So our Technology Training Programme supports students by helping them to develop skills to navigate these online platforms at Maynooth. It'll also help students to go from switching on a laptop to being quite efficient or very efficient, and it will start when it was at whatever stage you are at the process. So, for example, the Technology Transition Programme can provide support such as developing skills to help you with online researching. We can also help you to develop your typing skills using technology apps. So basically, we want to try and help you to work smarter and not harder. And this is going to help you enhance your learning experience. So keep an eye out for these two key supports, the laptop loans and also the Technology Transition Programme. And of course, you can discuss these with your student advisor who will give you more information about them both. 
Now in this slide, I'm going to give you a little bit more information about Student Central, because Student Central is a very big resource that we provide here at MAP. And um, the team of experts who are assistant psychologists from the National Learning Network have created online video guides and resources to help you learn useful new skills to reach your academic potential. So again, you can have a chat with your student advisor about Student Central and the kinds of supports that could be available to you. And for instance, there are video and webinars about note-taking, about academic writing, about preparing for your exams or managing stress, all very useful skills that can help you to have a more enjoyable learning experience whilst you're here at Maynooth University. So again, keep an eye out for the Student Central webpage, which is also as part of the Maynooth Access Programme webpage. And again, you can talk to your student advisor about this if you feel that this is a support that you think would be beneficial to you. So everyone, we've reached the end of our short presentation. And as always, I've said it a couple of times already in this presentation, don't be a stranger, come see us at MAP. Once you've completed your online registration and have been linked in with your student advisor, make sure you re reach out to them on a fairly regular basis because they will be able to support you through your educational journey as a student at Maynooth University. And also before I go, I want to alert you to some information about the upcoming Launchpad orientation, which will be taking place at the end of September. So Launchpad is a day of fun activities, talks and opportunities to mingle between with each other and other fellow new students. And it's designed to give you the best start to your third level career and to make sure you have everything you need for a stress free transition. So at Launchpad, we will cover important information about your course, the university service, tips and tricks for student life, and we'll showcase our inclusive campus and all the supports available to you as a university student. So on the day, MAP staff will be there, including myself. We'll have key university partners and students who will show you and your supporters around. So our MAP ambassadors will be out in force uh, during Launchpad and they will show you around and give you real good insider tips on what it's like to be a student at Maynooth University. So Launchpad is completely free to attend and refreshments will be provided. So key information about the available supports will be made available on the Launchpad webpage after the event. So you can review this at a later date because a lot of information will be shared on the day. And sometimes it's a good idea to pop back and have a look at this information when the dust has settled and you have more time and space to take in all that lovely information. So it's bye for me for now. And I look forward to meeting you during the Launchpad orientation in September and thank you very much for your time and attention and of course I must wish you the very best of luck and I hope that you have a wonderful educational journey in Maynooth University.